Look at this. What does this light tell you about light? Who is the actor and what is the stage? Stage is the light, the actor is the person. Exactly. Very good. Very good observation. Why do you say so? Well, this is the actor. It's, it, I, at first I thought it was opposite. Mm -hmm. But the thing is the light plays you actually. So exactly. The light is the stage that gives you the path of how you move and how you proceed towards acting towards the light. Very good observation, man. Good. Keep it up. What about this? There's a mystery behind this again. What is the mystery? Where's the light? Energy or each light for its pattern? Like the illuminance of the light. Where's the light? Do you see the pattern? Some of it. You can see the square on top. It doesn't work. And then it fades or fades in. Where's okay. The? It's not about the pattern. It is about... The Where the light's coming from? Yeah, where is the light coming from? That's the big question. Where is it coming from? Guess. Within each small chromatic piece? Nope. The light is invisible. You see, the bulbs are all fluorescent. Right? Yeah. Why do I say the green light is invisible? Because the room is green. No. The cones are green. So the light reflected from the cone is, is green. green. Oh, okay. So the, la the color of the light, which was green, is invisible. Right? Let's look at this. Somebody read it. Who's going to read it? Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead. Anyone? Go ahead. Metro is a lighting fixture made with one foil of three meter film OLF and two foils of polycarbonate that that structures when the packaging is unrolled with a simple gesture. Metro is not only a lamp but a system, a way to structure bidimensional elements creating a strong and efficient self structure object. So what is this? What did you understand by this? What do you understand by this? The structure itself? Is structure is a system, but itself is a light. It's a source of light. Where is the source of light coming? Around you. Do you see any coils, wires, electrical connections no. to this? No. So where is the light coming from? From inside. Polycarbonate. Have you heard of uh, optical cables? Fiber optics? Solar optical cables, not fiber optics. Oh. Fiber optics is used for internet. <laughs> Solar optic cables. Have you heard about them? Mm -hmm. What they do is they transfer, capture light. So in, in one of the tunnels in India, what they did is they let those tubes, they're very thin tubes, all right? They bunch them up and let the tubes where the opening of the tunnel is and let the tubes run through the tunnel. What they do is they capture the sunlight and transfer the sunlight into the tunnel, bringing light naturally. No wires used. Absolutely. Isn't that brilliant? So Isn't that self-sustainable? You're not using wire, using sunlight. During the night, they capture the, they've captured the sunlight, right? During the day. Mm -hmm. So they have it on during the night. It has a sensor which tells them that Hey, there's no light, so let's turn on. Right? So there's a sensor. Now what happens with that? What happens with that? Yeah. Yes. Because it is sensor based. Now they've added an additional movement sensor to that. So it's shut off when nobody is moving in the tunnel. So it still conserves the light for a longer time period. And when a vehicle passes by or a passerby passes by, it's closed up. And 
there is a city in india called tirupati i have worked on the sustainability aspect of it and i have received a grant for working for that city that city uses all street lights that have solar energy that that work on solar energy, energy i'm sorry and have motion sensors light sensors so if there is a light that falls on the lamp post it lights up why do you need light to fall on the lamp post to light up it's a street light right mm-hmm. so the car is coming from a distance and it's pitch dark they don't know where to go so when the cars light headlights are turned on and they fall on the lamp post it keeps getting turned on all the time so you see the entire path safer yes so i guess it's more like a for sure the car's path but so the person cuz person has no headlights no the first it, i told you it has a movement sensor a movement and a light and sensor light. it has both so it conserves light <coughs> and what else does it do absorbs the light energy too and the best part about that city is it gets its 45% of its electrical usage energy usage to sustainable means there is no non renewable energy sources used we are working towards getting to 64% by 2014 that's the aim and we want to do that by reducing public transport dependence on gas right how many of you know that i have a sustainability blog and a digital design blog how many of you have read about your instructor on the website i mean i saw a blog but you post some some like some video and other stuff on it 